Good morning, everyone, and welcome. Today is February the 3rd, and I am so excited, okay? I met this wonderful lady, and it was very serendipitous through another friend of mine. And what I did was the very first thing I did, she was having this big virtual empowerment session. You can tell them about it, Tammy. Anyway, and so we met, and it's just like I was drawn to her. Now today, I'm going to interview her because she sent me a book, Get Up, Dust Yourself Off. She's a very famous author, um, speaker, she can tell you. And then look at, I have my wonderful t-shirt. <laughs> Dust Yourself Off. And I read this book and it brought me to tears. And now I know why she is who she is and what she does, a very soulful lady. You know, Game Changer for me was all about the new model of relationship. And the first relationship is with self. And that is about self-discovery, um, introspection and whatever. So now Tammy, I'm gonna just let you go. And I'm gonna tell you, just share about yourself and about the book. And then we have another surprise later on because she has another book. <laughs> okay, Tammy, thank you. Tammy Durden, here she is. Well, awesome. Good morning, Sandra. I am so super excited to be on with you today. Thank you so much for the opportunity to share about who I am and the book and hopefully give some inspiring words uh, to help the listeners on their journey to personal growth and development. Again, my name is Tammy Durden, international speaker, author, and image coach. And what I absolutely love doing is empowering people to live their best life, to overcome challenges and setbacks, and to live their best life now. And one of the ways that I do that is through writing, uh, also through speaking and coaching. But today we're talking about my book, Get Up, Dust Yourself Off and Win. And Get Up, Dust Yourself Off and Win is an empowerment tool to help individuals to push past those setbacks, to help them along their journey in personal growth and development, to know that you don't have to live in your past, but you can overcome those setbacks, you can learn from it, grow from it, and move forward to live your best life now. Absolutely. That's powerful. And so Tammy, you also have these uh, conferences. Yes, every year I have a conference, it's called the Get Up, Dust Yourself Off and Win Conference. And each year it's a different thing. That conference was built on the back of this book to on an annual basis. And it's a women's empowerment conference, but we actually opened it up to men last year. And so we, we use the conference to empower people on their journey. Although the staple of the conference is get up, dust yourself off and win, but there's a different theme each year. Last year we talked about relationships and loving yourself. So each year there's a different thing, a different thing to the conference. And again, people come from across the country and hopefully soon from across the world uh, to be a part of that experience because Sandra, it is indeed an experience, a life-changing experience that catapults people to the next dimension in their lives. Right, well this year, you it was virtual and I would have loved to have gone, but for me, being able to, to participate virtually just opened my world and it was just unreal there was so much there was so much love there was so much wisdom there was so much energy okay and i and i'm sure that you i would love to see you come to canada to do some speaking engagements and hopefully anybody i will send it to different people to say you know what really look at this and get the book in canada or they can get your book on amazon can't they Absolutely. The book is on Amazon and it's also on my website, TammyDurden.com uh, as well. Get Up, Dust Yourself Off the Wind is also on Audible. It's an audio book as well. So we have the printed paperback version, we have the audio book, and you can get it on Kindle on Amazon. Right. So with the world the way it is right now, Tammy, we know from my point of view, there's a lot of challenges because we're going through a lot of transformation because I look at the cycles, the cosmic cycles, okay? And so we can allow that to affect us or we can 
really align with spirit and so mm-hmm. I need to really keep just doing what I'm doing. What can you say about that? Can you say something about that for people today? Absolutely. I think that, uh, you know, life is life and the world is going to continue as it continues. But what's important to know is that we have the power over our lives and the power to change. We have control over the energy that we carry. Uh, We are spirit beings living in physical bodies. And so despite what's happening and, and all the forces that be and all of the things that are going on in the world, we have the power to set the atmosphere in our own lives. We have the power to harness the energy and uh, have a protective shield around our spirit so that we can emit the positive energy, so that we can attract the good things that are coming into our lives. We, that power resides in us. We have the ability to set the pace and the standard and create our own lives. Perfect. That's exactly it. And another thing that I really enjoyed is um, you had a lot of work that you did on yourself Mm -hmm. in the book. And that's what she shares with you, her journey. And most individuals, the majority, I would say, a big percentage of them have really not had an easy life. And so as they go on their journey, they learn. Okay. And I always say, People will say, well, physical fitness, we have to work out. And I go, it's the same with spiritual fitness and it's the spiritual uh, and the physical. And so I'll I'll tell you, I've read a lot of books in my life. Okay. Mm -hmm. One that I know, um, Victor Frankl, The Meaning of Life. I always go back to that one, how it didn't matter how hard it was. And like I say, I've read a lot. And this, your book, you took me right into your heart and I lived every moment of your journey from when you were younger to where you are, the hardships, the good part, everything. And that's what I appreciate about it. The authenticity of, of spirit and soul I think, is what really connected Tammy. Okay. And so... I, I think that's it. If you have any more you can say, to me, it's always short, sweet, to the point. And I know people are very busy and that's why I'm very careful just to put so many videos out on the YouTube. Because mm-hmm. once I want, I want them to be really powerful and I want them to, to assist in their, in their spiritual growth and their own personal self-discovery. Yes. If I can just leave a few parting words, Sandra, I'd like to encourage everyone and let everybody to know that you're not alone. We've we've all had setbacks and challenges. We've all had so many things that we've endured and that we have overcome, but know that you're not alone and you don't have to feel ashamed. And also know that you don't have to live in your past because your past is just that. You know, learn from your mistakes, your failures, your setbacks, We've all made poor choices. Some things that we've encountered in our lives, you know, we didn't ask for it. Life just happened. But that's okay. The good news is that you don't have to stay down. You can get up. You can dust it off. You can forgive yourself, love yourself, forgive those who hurt you, and move on. Because the thing about forgiveness is forgiveness is more for me than it is for the other person. If you want to really heal from your past and move forward to live your best life now, Forgive, heal, and move forward so that you can live your dreams, so that you can walk in purpose. Because the fact of the matter is we were all designed and created for purpose. Everything that we go through is a part of our purpose to help someone else so that we can come, become better, so that we can become greater, so that we can be a light to help show others by what we've gone through that, so that they can live their best life. So be encouraged, be inspired, know that your life matters, your past doesn't define your destiny, and you can move forward to live your best life now. Wow. With that, I thank you so much. And uh, everybody, I hope you love this. And she, I, we, I send my love. And check out her book and her audio. And thank you so much, Tammy. Thank you.